Hi, I'm Katina Houston Stroud with Family Links, and this is the Family Tip of the Week. Family and togetherness are key themes for the holidays. That can make the holidays awfully difficult for people who are grieving the loss of a loved one. If the grief is fresh, holiday cheer can seem like an insult. Celebrations may underscore how alone people feel, and although grief is nearly universal, it expresses itself in many different ways and sometimes resembles major depression. Frequent crying spells, depressed moods, sleep disturbances, and loss of appetite are common during the bereavement process. Grief is not a tidy, orderly process, and there's no way, right way to grieve. Every person and every family does it differently. Here are the strategies that may help you or someone you know who is grieving to cope with the holidays. Number one, start a new tradition. During a holiday dinner, place a lighted candle on the dinner table, leave an empty chair, or say a few words of remembrance. Number two, change the celebration. Go out to dinner instead of planning an elaborate meal at home or schedule a trip with friends. Number three, express your needs. People who are grieving may find it hard to participate in all the festivities or may need to let go of unsatisfying traditions. It's all right to tell people you just aren't up to it right now or to change the plans that you've made. Number four, help someone else. It may also help to volunteer through a charitable or religious organization. Make a donation to a favorite cause in memory of the person who died. But remember, give yourself time. The grieving process doesn't neatly conclude at the six month or one year mark. Depending on the strength of the bond that was broken, grief can be lifelong. Nevertheless, grief does usually soften and change over time. And with time, the holidays will become easier to handle. For more information on family issues, please contact Family Links at 256-820-5911.